we're doing the whole thing as like a royal court, right? Yeah. Okay, just want to make sure. Who dare approach the king's bench? What are the first three words you said? <laughs> I said quing. Yeah, but you, in the first three, I didn't understand either. Who dares approach? Who dares approach? Did you guys have that? <laughs> yeah, it sounds like an over for three. 50, 50. <laughs> Sam had it. No. My name is Jimmy, his name is Jake, and this is... The Weekly Dumb. A little behind the scenes. A little behind baseball. We're recording Peel this early. The curtains. Uh, we're recording this early because someone's going on vacation. It's me and it's Zach. Mostly Zach. So all the employee of the months revoked. Gone. Fired. Looking for a new editor. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, Jake, Shaq. Short for Shaquille. Who? So many people forget that. Who forgot that? The vast majority of people forget that it's short. I don't think they think it's just his name, like Cher, which is actually short for Shereen. Anyway, he picked his nose on TV. Thoughts? Live there. Uh, actually, there's a pretty good gif of that that maybe we can add to this. I'm trying to bring back nose picking, so I might not be the right guy for this. Uh, pick your nose. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know where you're going to go after that. I didn't either. <laughs> okay, so that's one thing. We've covered that topic. He also, they showed a picture of him uh, hiking up his shorts, his basketball shorts, to show off his ass in the background of an interview when he was young, which also, <laughs> we have a video of Jake doing that <laughs> from the playoffs last year. Are you Shaquille O'Neal? Shaq and I are very similar people, and I don't think a lot of people would instantly think that. But or ever. Even after you say that, I don't see it. I think me and Shaq would have a good time. Fair. Uh, yeah. Yeah. At a meet and greet? At a greet and meet. How are you spelling meet? <laughs> Is Shaq the most beloved person in the world? Mm -hmm. It's like up there, right? Who would be rivaling him? Dolly Parton. Yeah, it's a good one. Yeah. No one's got anything bad to say about her. Me, Shaq, and Dolly Parton would be a good time. Yes. People don't think of me, though. I have you of the annoying waiter. Pick your ear, pick your nose. What an episode for you. Up for me. Yeah. And this shirt. Yes. Brought to you uh, by Thrift uh. Stars. Oh, <laughs> me, me, me. Back at you, Zach. Oh, next story. I like this story a lot. Jim, can I ask you about the next story? Yeah, I like this story a lot. Jim, can I ask you about the next story? Yeah, I like this story a lot. Jim, can I ask you about the next story? Yeah, I like this story a lot. Mm. Headline writers don't speak English. Oh, this is And bad. they're my biggest nemesis. Can I read it in the voice of the person who made this headline? Yeah. Nowhere to go. Portable toilet inventory wiped out in Central Florida. Shortage could affect upcoming events. I have it more like this. Nowhere to go. Portable toilet inventory wiped out in Central Florida. Shortage could affect upcoming events. I think this is Britain attacking Florida. Like, easy, they're out of topics. Nowhere to go. Portable toilet inventory wiped out in Central Florida. Shortage could affect upcoming events. Two, three, four. <laughs> uh, yeah, so in Florida, they have a law that says if you have a public gathering, you need to provide... Porta potties. If it's fifty people for one hour, you only need one porta potty. If it's twenty thousand people for one hour, you need twenty five porta potties. If it's five hundred for nine hours, five hundred people nine hours, you need ten. Now, can I tell you something that is absolutely disgusting? But I want to run it by Zach. Why not me? Uh, it's a videographer stuff, so just butt the fuck out. Um, okay, how about a GoPro inside the porta potty on time lapse of all the shit and piss just nope. slowly <laughs> filling? <laughs> Come on, have you saw a YouTube video like time lapse of inside a porta potty and it was just the piss and shit? Just oh, I've seen videos like that. Like, <laughs> if you're throwing a six hour event with 50,000 people, you need 381 porta johns. Happening. I'm using my dugout mug to hit balls at you. Contact. Contact. He got me. <laughs> he got me. I quit. I quit. This is a mess. Zach. I'm in How? the Porter Johns, man. You are? Yeah. Whoa, fuck, yeah. man. That's weirder than what I said. You know I'm a poop anytime guy. Yeah, that's true. Tell yeah. him the famous poop story. Oh, high school baseball. I um, pooped in a trash can. Jake pooped in a trash can. And it was like when uh, cell phone- Why did I poop in the trash can, Jim? Because I beat you to the toilet. After I complained about needing to poop the whole ride home. But everyone had to poop. 
Not everyone had to poop. I didn't go in. And the, there's levels of poop. I mean, everybody poops. I didn't go, Fair. but I didn't go in the. Did you or did you not run faster to the Porter John because you knew I had to poop? Because I also. It's not like I went in there and just the hung out. The defense asked one question. But it's not like I. You always paint it like I didn't also have to poop. I, I went in there and I hung. It's not like I Do just you think hung you had out. to poop more than me? Well, that's not a fair concern. That's a very fair concern. That's the number one concern of pooping. I also had to go. It's like a top Didn't three want to concern it. of pooping. So we had to stand on the bench in the middle of the locker room and pants reveal <laughs> and poop and poop into it. And uh, it was like when cell phone videos. It was 2003. It was like cell phone videos just became a thing. So people were filming him, and he was like, "Guys, come on! Like, don't take pictures." And then um, yeah. I hate when we record the weekly dumb early. Yeah, I don't know if we should do it again, dude. This next story is stupid. Peta is suggesting changing the name of Ham Lake to Yam Lake. Now it's called Ham Lake because it looks like a piece of ham. Just because it's called Ham Lake, that could be in celebration of pigs. I mean, ham is traditionally a dead pig being eaten. So I think Pete is trying to get away from that. I don't think naming it Ham Lake means that people are killing more pigs. I don't know. The Finger Lakes in Connecticut? You think people are chopping off fingers? Because they're going to the Finger Lake? I don't think if the finger preservists were trying to save it, then yes. They do not have a loud voice yet. Favorite finger. Three, two, one. Thumb. Pointer. Minnesota Senator Michelle Benson, whose district includes Ham Lake, has another suggestion for renaming the city. Steak Ooh. Lake. So she's feisty. She's attacking PETA. Now PETA's in a tough position. Who do they like more? Pigs or cows? It's the employee of the week. It's the employee of the week. It's the uh, it's Emily. Well, I think we have a little housekeeping before we get to Emily. Uh, Not Emily yet, because Zach's uh, making us record this early. We have decided to revoke his employee of the month trophies. Here, here, dugout mugs. Um, tell them about the employee. Of the week. It's Emily. Jonathan sent me an email and said that his girlfriend, Emily, really likes the Weekly Dumb and she would love to be... She said her her life goal is to be Employee of the Week. So congratulations to Emily. We will never be doing yeah. this again. Unless you Venmo me a lot of money. Oh, no. Also, Lou Ellen, who's a, our best, most lovable super fan. She deserves her own. If you made it to the end of this Weekly Dumb, can you find all the people commenting that said they couldn't because it was it was the stupidest one yet and just tell them, like, it's all right. They'll be back to normal later. If anyone thinks I'm gross from picking my nose Showing my your ear, butt, shitting in public. Showing how I pooped in front of people. It's a tough episode for you. Get over yourself. No. You've done all of that. Well... Probably not the pooping thing into Maybe a garbage can. Things. Not a lot of people have stood on a bench and pooped into a garbage can. You're one of few. It's the employee of the week. It's the, we already did it. That was a weekly dumb. Support for this show was brought to you by Dugout Mugs. They currently have an early bird Father's Day sale happening now. Use code DUMB to get 35% off all MLB Dugout Mugs. Wind-ups, season openers, and knob shots. Now eat it. Go. Oh.